All right, what's going on guys? Another very windy day here in Thailand. I tried to fish this morning, but that didn't work out. Tried to kind of fish the surf off of some rocks and the tide was too high, too rough. So we'll probably head back at some point later on this week. But right now we're back at the pier that I have fished several times now, uh, just cause I know there's still gonna be a lot of uh, species here that I could possibly catch. So we're gonna try to get into some of those here. Uh, just a little bit of shrimp on the bottom and we'll see what we can get here on this really windy day once again. Alright, so there's our rig, one ounce sinker. Uh, it's a size 12 octopus hook with a little bit of shrimp. Let's just kind of flick it on out there into some somewhat open water. And we'll see what we can pick up here. is uh, a pretty cool catch but one that I've caught yesterday I believe all right so first catch of the day this is a wrasse uh, I believe it's gonna be a floral wrasse caught one of these guys yesterday but it is a pretty cool looking fish cooler than a lot of the wrasses that I catch so I don't mind this guy good little start to the day even hit the bottom see what we got all right all right also caught one of these guys yesterday I believe it's a white streak monocle bream if I'm not mistaken so the first two catches that we got so far a little bit rarer only caught two of each over my several days fishing here now but nothing new for the lifeless yet Got him. Let's see what we got. What is this? Yes, let's go. New species. All right, so I forgot the name of this one, but it's some sort of a damselfish. Uh, I would really like to thank SG Multi Species Fishing. Uh, link to his Instagram will be in the description. He has helped me out tremendously uh, during my trip last summer to Singapore, as well as during this trip here. Uh, he caught these guys in that exact same spot and he told me to make some casts there for him and honestly it worked out. Took a little perseverance and persistence. Got my bait stolen a bunch of times but he, he has not let me down yet. So whatever kind of damsel this is, new species for the life list and big thanks to him uh, for giving me that little tip there. What is this? Uh, a blue line hand. All right, so it's a really good looking blue line hand. Seems like today we're getting all the repeats we caught yesterday. So three of the four fish we caught today were new species yesterday. But this, this is, is it the most beautiful? I haven't caught a lot of groupers, but I think this is gonna be the most beautiful grouper I've ever caught. So solid catch for the day. Let's get it back. And let's see what else we can get out of here. Got 
got him. That's going to be another eel. I think I caught one of these guys yesterday, though. Yeah, so all the fish we're catching today are just ones we caught one of yesterday. Caught a bunch of new ones yesterday for the life list. And basically all the ones we're catching today are repeats. Would have been cool if this was a different species, but this looks to be a, uh, a white-eyed, is it a white-eyed moray? I think so. So let's get this guy back and let's keep fishing. Still a pretty cool catch. Got him. What is this? That's another blue line hen. All right, so once again, we got a beautiful blue line hen. Definitely the most beautiful grouper I've ever caught. One of the more beautiful fish as well. So we got some fish under the pier, but basically they're all repeat so far. But let's keep going. Got him. Another floral wrasse looks like. Alrighty, so it is our second floral wrasse of the day, third one in my life. It is a really beautiful fish. I don't know if these guys are like masters of camouflage down there, but kind of that pattern makes it look like they blend into whatever, whatever they're near really well. But cool catch anyway. Let's keep going. Oh, that was quick, so we just hit the bottom. Now this is a more boring wrasse. So that floral wrasse was cool. This thing is anything but cool. This I believe is gonna be a diamond wrasse, which I've caught many dozens of in Singapore. This is definitely the most common fish uh, in Singaporean waters, at least from my experience, the way I fish. So definitely not a cool catch, but another new one for the day. Got him. That's gonna be just a boring wrasse. All right, so it's been a very long time between catches. I moved spots, tried out different baits and different rigs, and this is the first fish I've caught in a while. It's a zigzag wrasse. So first one of these guys for the day, but I've caught plenty of these over my last several days here. Got him. What do we got? Another wrasse. All right, so again, most wrasses are really pretty, especially in the tropics. And this is a very pretty wrasse, but they are rather annoying. So I've had my fun here. We got one new species today. Uh, let's go ahead, let's get this uh, zigzag wrasse back. And let's go ahead, let's wrap it up for this session. All right guys, so that's gonna do it. And this wasn't really a bad session. We didn't catch a lot of fish, um, but we did get a lot of cool species. Yesterday I caught most of these for the first time and I haven't caught too many of them. So even though they're repeats, a lot of them were still pretty cool. Those blue lined hens were really cool. Um, that white-eyed uh, moray was really cool. 
I've only ever caught three moray eels and two of them have come in the last two days. So it was still a pretty good fishing session. And we did get one new species in whatever uh, yellowish white uh, damsel fish that ended up being. So this pier, this pier's tough. Uh, not an outstanding variety that I've been able to find, but you can pick away at a couple cool species here and there. Uh, so like I said in a couple previous videos, my hotel is about a two, three minute walk from here. That's why I've mainly fished here a lot over the last several days. I got a few days left here in Thailand, so I'll probably be back here at some point. Still got to make a night fishing trip. I'm curious to see what kind of species are here at night. Uh, so that'll be cool. Got to do that at some point. Anyway, I uh, hope you guys liked it and I will see you next time.